so me and keep those who be as that show star the rest more. Thank you. All right. Fluent. Yeah. Krista Siegfried's taught me. Oh, yeah. nice. She's amazing. She lives here in this city. Yeah. With baby. It's amazing. Yeah. yeah. You yeah. know what's awesome? She's sent us some messages, like liking all the pictures we we be posting. And oh, yeah. what a star. She's cool. But you know who's also cool is your newest member. Oh, thank yeah. you. Me. <laughs> Have they welcomed you with open arms? Absolutely. I feel like, I actually feel like I've been in this band forever now. Even home. Yeah, yeah. This is this is our new family, so mm -hmm. I'm enjoying it. Are you like Jezebel in any way? Ah, uh, no, not at all. <laughs> <laughs> Let me ask them: Is she like Jezebel in any way? You know, what fun fun thing is that the song was written about this strong, independent, rebellious woman, and then two months after, she comes. Yeah, in the it picture. Was what? Kind of, yeah, it was kind of like almost creepy to hear the song. Wow. After joining the band, yeah, like, so. oh my god, this is, yeah, I recognize myself. <laughs> now, is it true you live in Hawaii? Yeah. Wow. I mean, how does that happen? I just went there and I <laughs> started living I there. I started living there. It's simple as that. <laughs> Not a boat. How does it happen? I, I was a bit afraid when, when, when he moved there that all the songs will be with ukulele or something like lace, you know, stuff like that. But, but luckily the, the darkness mm. didn't, uh, yeah, darkness stayed. In. There's a little bit more light in this song, right? Yeah, yeah. there is. Yeah. A little Waikiki, I feel it. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Which island are you on? Oahu. Okay. Yeah. My God. And you, Mister, are you the Zen master of the group? Like, do you keep everyone calm? Um, I don't know about that, but I try to meditate every morning to keep myself calm, at least. Yeah, it's like that, like daytime, but night nightlife with this guy is crazy. <laughs> Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I'm, in, I'm in your party. <laughs> may, oh yeah, the Wee Wee Jam at home, they will be doing a special performance. Yeah. It may or may not be X-rated, I can't tell you. I haven't downloaded the file, the server blocked it. In any case, staging in Torino, what can we expect? Will it be like at UMK or something different? It's different. So oh, we yeah. Have, oh. yeah. <laughs> boom, boom, boom. We have a new idea. Yes. New idea. Ah. Yeah, we can't tell too much, mm. but we really want to show the joy of playing, you know, playing together, the chemistry between us, we want to underline that even more. And, you know, we love what we do, and we want that to show. That, that's the most important thing. But de definitely something different from the UMK show. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Final question for you. What do you want Europe to remember about the Rasmus or Finland after Eurovision? Hmm. <laughs> That's a good question. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Or what do you want them to forget? Just kidding. Probably, <laughs> probably exactly the band energy that Laura was talking about. Because we love what we do, and I think when we four are on the stage together, there's something kind of magical happening there. Yeah. So, yeah. I think that we also want to promote the Finnish sauna. So we want after Eurovision, we want all the fans to come to sauna with us in Finland and have a swim in the lake. How big is this sauna? Who owed us? <laughs> You're opening semi-final two? two? Yeah. Oh, that's an honor, yeah? Yes. Yeah. It is an honor. It is nice. Oh Y'all better vote. <laughs> all right, we'll see you later. Bye.